What the hell ever happened in those days of the World Wrestling Federation? Guess I'll never find out. Oh, fuck all goddamn walls. Uh, wait a minute. I know you. Alright, anyway, cut the bullshit. What's up, YouTube? It's called for 1 5 This is actually my official update video. Oh, um, we... Not from last night. Last night, if you saw my last video, that was just a, um, prediction video for Extreme Rules. I will get into that in a minute. I did not see the pay-per-view personally, but I've had people call me up about it, and I've seen a shitload of videos on YouTube, like just results and everything. I can tell you right now, it looked like a fucking badass pay-per-view. Like I was doing last night, Skull, uh, did not Skull. Ah, damn it, dropped the dub. Uh, Stoker's Mint. More snuff, long cut. This stuff is amazing. And yes, I was watching World Wrestling, an old WWF video. If you remember the match from the Royal Rumble, t 1999, no 2000. My bad. It was it was Royal Rumble 2000. Triple H versus Cactus Jack in a street fight for the World Wrestling Federation, aka WWF Championship, and not WWE. So if y'all got a can on you, sit back, pa pack a fatty, or a hammer, or a lip, or whatever you call it. I don't give a shit what you call it. I call it whatever the hell. I, mix, I change it up in a while. Pack your, pack it, pack the shit, and throw in a dip skate and enjoy the video. Because this is going to be a doozy. We're going to talk about last night's pay-per-view. going to talk about what, and I'm going to talk about what I'm going to do with this channel. Today, more drug of the day. Self-explanatory. Don't need to say shit to it. So yeah, it's been about a, it's been more than a, it's been about two months since I did my uh, actual video, other than that um r extreme rules video I did last night. So here's what's been going. All right, before I get into anything, um. Lately, I just have not been able to make videos as much as I want to have been busy. Um, I am going to start getting back into the swings of things again with uh, making videos. I'm not really going to bore you guys or anything. So yeah, uh, I've been busy. It's all hell. Uh, I've been going through a lot of personal shit. School's been hellish. Um, and, you know... I got a major bowling tournament coming up. It wouldn't get like five hundred thousand dollars, some shit like that. So you know, big money, I could use it. So yeah. Anyways, um, I will start making videos again, probably like once a week or, um, you know, like periodically, like I was before. But it's just gonna take me a while to get back in the swing of things because I I do have to find time. And as far as I know, that's just the up my update and everything. Um. Ooh, sorry, my god, that size hurt. All right, anyways. Um. All right, so from what I heard last, all right, so moving on to something a little bit more interesting than just me sitting here, like this, like I normally am with uh, every other video. But I'm going to be a little bit more hyperactive. I've talked, to, I think I've talked about that. I've talked about that. I don't remember. Ah, fuck it, I don't give a shit. Mm. So yeah, last night's rest, uh, last night, bleh, last night, last night's um Extreme Rules pay per view. I heard it's freaking just amazing. So like, I heard it was probably it would probably be one of the most memorable, well, most memorable pay per views in years, and that's saying something due to WWE just being what they are right now. <laughs> but, um, you know, like, with them going through the PG, with them as the PG era, in my opinion, and the shit era, because that's basically all, that's basically what it is. It's shit. I mean, I still watch it because I'm, I've always been a true hard WWE fan, slash wrestling fan in general. I mean, everybody knows that. <laughs> 
Yeah, you know, in just about every single one of my videos, you'll see me with this. Am I right or am I wrong? At least once you'll see me mention my wrestling, uh, wrestling in one form or another. But yeah, um, from what I heard, it was a phenomenal match. There was blood in the pay-per-view, which I know excited a lot of people. Um, sadly, though, John Cena is probably going to be out due to injury. Uh, so yeah. But, I don't know, if you guys can find me a link on where I can watch this pay-per-view, I want to fucking watch so badly. The reason I didn't order it, like, I, I was thinking about ordering it, but... The reason I didn't is because I ordered WrestleMania this uh, on Sunday. Well, April 1st during the night. Let me tell you something, guys. The WrestleMania pay-per-view, it was good, but not their best. It was no, like, um... It wasn't like WrestleMania 24 or... Um... You know, WrestleMania 20 with matches like that. But it was a pretty good pay-per-view. Top three matches of the night would, of course, be Hell in a Cell. Um, CM Punk versus Chris Jericho. By the way, I heard the match at last night's pay-per-view. It's twice as good as as um the one at WrestleMania. I mean... Really? I don't think it should be the opposite way around. Well, yeah, fuck it. It is what it is. I mean... In my opinion, they made WrestleMania kind of as, as a joke this year, but whatever. This is... We're past WrestleMania. If you're a wrestling fan, you've passed... We've passed all that shit. From what I heard, also, Brock Lesnar's gonna get fired, so that's gonna be pretty interesting to see this tonight on Monday Night Raw. Mm. Alright. Alright, now let's actually move on to shit. I've actually... Lately, I've been dipping on stokers for the past month or so. Good. As you can tell, I got two tubs of it. This one, uncracked. Yeah, compared to 10 cans and say, God, I got both of these for like 20 bucks, man. I'm like, what the fuck? That's a good-ass deal. Oh, and, that's, and if you haven't heard yet, there are new mud jugs on mudjug.com. The fire mud jug. This one, right here. One of my all-time favorite mud jugs. <laughs> Discontinue. Sorry. If you didn't get it, you're shit out of luck. It's gone, and it's gone forever. And guess what, guys? I've said this before. The, the green and black mud jug are gone. These are really nice mud jugs for basics. I really like these. Yeah. And since I'm a winter green guy... Really fits. Right. I'm actually gonna move some Copenhagen winter green. Shit always made my nipples so hard. And of course, Stokers makes my balls so blue. I don't get it. It's the complete opposite. I don't fucking know. I don't know. Yeah, sorry. Wait, why did I just say sorry? I don't know. I'm a fucking idiot tonight. Anyway, so. Alright, I'm just gonna do a quick review on Stokers. If you have, if you guys have never seen Stokers, and you guys, if you never had Stokers, you guys are fucking messing out. This shit, look at this. Alright, that's without even fucking packing it, alright? That stuff is long as hell. And moist as hell. I swear to God, this stuff is so freaking juicy that when I'm down in the closet, it comes with the refillable can and no lie when i'm down to like my last pinch of this in the can my fingers will juice up i will get juice everywhere it's amazing mm. of course 12 ounces of tobacco up here american tobacco right yeah, it's 100 percent isn't it yep leaf contents yeah. My big blue ass this can. So yeah, Stokers really high, highly recommend it. I give it a nine out of ten. One of my favorite di Stokers Mint is definitely one of my favorite dips out there. Uh, if you can't get it at your store, get it off Northerner.com, people. Come on. Common sense. 
All right, anyways, um, uh, one more thing. I'm also going to be doing a couple, of, I'm probably also going to be doing, um, a couple of wrestling, new wrestling videos. Now, these are going to be a little bit different. Um, I'm going to actually be watching old pay-per-views, and I'm going to give you my review on them. For example, I'm going to be watching, because I actually have it up right now, I'm watching, I'm actually watching the parts of the 2000 Royal Rumble. Now, I will watch it, I have, for example, if you want me to review a WWE or WWF, ECW, TNA, WCW pay-per-view, shoot me a freaking message or comment, alright? I will watch the pay-per-view, and I'll do a review on it, alright? Now, if you don't like the idea, then just don't say shit to it. I really don't care. I'm just looking for a new segment to do, and I thought that would be pretty cool, in my opinion. Alright guys, well that does it for me. This is Skull Dipper 125 I am signing off of YouTube. Stay tuned for the next video. And remember, if you wanted me to review a pay-per-view, leave me let me know. Tell me the name, the year. Because let's face it, if you just say fucking for example, WWE No Way Out. What year? 2001, 1999, 2002. You guys gotta be specific. Not saying you guys aren't, I'm not saying that you guys aren't, but still, I know how people are out there, right? I'm not saying it's all of you, but there's a good chunk of you. And I'm not talking about the YouTube the dip community either. I'm talking about all the other idiots out there. I don't know what I'm talking about. So yeah, that is it, guys. Wrap your gums, save your fucking lungs. Peace.